The difference between NPN and PNP transistor. NPN, negative positive negative, and PNP, positive negative positive, transistors are two common types of bipolar junction transistors, BJTs, which are semiconductor devices used for amplifying or switching electronic signals. The key difference between them lies in their doping and current flow characteristics. Doping type NPN transistor In an NPN transistor, the semiconductor material is typically composed of three layers, a thin P-type layer sandwiched between two N-type layers. This means that the majority charge carriers in the NPN transistor are electrons, negative charge carriers. PNP transistor In a PNP transistor, the arrangement is reversed. It has three layers with a thin N-type layer sandwiched between two P-type layers. In a PNP transistor, the majority charge carriers are holes, positive charge carriers. Current flow direction NPN transistor In an NPN transistor, the current flows from the collector, N-type, to the emitter, N-type, through the base, P-type. This means that for the transistor to conduct or amplify a signal, a small current must flow from the base to the emitter allowing a larger current to flow from the collector to the emitter. PNP transistor In a PNP transistor, the current flows from the emitter, P-type, to the collector, P-type, through the base, N-type. Like in an NPN transistor, a small current from the base to the emitter controls a larger current flowing from the emitter to the collector. Symbol representation NPN transistors are represented with an arrow pointing outward from the base, indicating the direction of electron flow. PNP transistors are represented with an arrow pointing inward toward the base, indicating the direction of hole flow. Voltage polarities NPN transistors are typically used in applications where the base emitter junction is forward biased, positive voltage on the base with respect to the emitter. PNP transistors are typically used in applications where the base emitter junction is reverse biased, negative voltage on the base with respect to the emitter. In summary, NPN and PNP transistors are complementary in their operation. NPN transistors are more commonly used because electrons are the majority charge carriers in most semiconductor materials. However, PNP transistors have their applications, especially in certain analog and switching circuits, where they are used to handle positive currents and voltages. Common Applications NPN transistors NPN transistors are widely used in various electronic applications, including amplifiers, digital logic gates, and switching circuits. They are commonly employed in low-side switching configurations, where the load is connected to the collector terminal and the base emitter junction is forward biased to turn the transistor on. PNP transistors PNP transistors are often used in complementary circuits to NPN transistors. They are suitable for high-side switching applications, where the load is connected between the emitter and a positive voltage source. PNP transistors are also utilized in analog circuits where negative voltage supplies are required. Current Gain both NPN and PNP transistors have a current gain, denoted as beta, beta, or HFE, which represents the ratio of the collector current, IC, to the base current, IB. The actual value of beta can vary depending on the transistor's characteristics and manufacturer. NPN transistors typically have higher beta values than PNP transistors. Inverting and non-inverting NPN and PNP transistors can be thought of as inverting and non-inverting amplifiers, respectively. An NPN transistor's output is in phase with its input, while a PNP transistor's output is out of phase with its input. This characteristic can be important when designing circuits that require specific signal phase relationships. Complementary Pair in some applications, NPN and PNP transistors are used together as a complementary pair to handle both positive and negative currents. This is common in push-pull amplifiers and H-bridge motor driver circuits where NPN transistors handle positive currents and PNP transistors handle negative currents to control bidirectional current flow. In summary, NPN and PNP transistors are fundamental components in electronics, with their distinct characteristics and applications.
Understanding the differences between them is essential for designing and troubleshooting electronic circuits, as the choice between NPN and PNP transistors depends on the specific requirements of the circuit and the direction of current flow. Voltage ratings NPN and PNP transistors often have different voltage ratings. For example, in NPN transistors, the collector emitter voltage, VCE, typically needs to be positive for proper operation, whereas in PNP transistors, VCE should be negative. The specific voltage ratings depend on the transistor's specifications and the manufacturer's datasheet. Switching speed NPN and PNP transistors can have different switching characteristics. Generally, NPN transistors tend to switch faster than PNP transistors. This can be important in high-frequency applications, where fast switching is required. Temperature considerations The temperature characteristics of NPN and PNP transistors can differ. Designers need to consider the temperature range in which the transistors will operate when selecting the appropriate type for a specific application. Compatibility NPN and PNP transistors are often used in conjunction with complementary components. For instance, NPN transistors are typically paired with N-channel MOSFETs, while PNP transistors are paired with P-channel MOSFETs in complementary push-pull amplifier configurations. Darlington Pair In some applications where very high current gain is required, multiple transistors can be connected together in a configuration known as a Darlington Pair. This combines the current gain of two transistors and is often used with NPN transistors, resulting in an even higher overall current gain. Noise Characteristics NPN and PNP transistors can exhibit slightly different noise characteristics. Noise can be a consideration in sensitive analog circuits, so the choice of transistor type may be influenced by noise performance requirements. In conclusion, the choice between NPN and PNP transistors depends on the specific needs of a circuit and the direction of current flow. Both types have their unique characteristics and applications, and understanding these differences is essential for effective circuit design and troubleshooting. Designers must consider voltage requirements, current gain, switching speed, and other factors to select the appropriate transistor type for a given application. Continue. Certainly, here's the continuation of the discussion on NPN and PNP transistors. Voltage compatibility. NPN and PNP transistors have different voltage compatibility with respect to the power supply voltage. When using NPN transistors in a common emitter configuration, for example, the collector voltage, VCE, should be higher than the emitter voltage, VE. In contrast, for PNP transistors in a common emitter configuration, VCE should be lower than VE. Designers must pay attention to these voltage relationships to ensure proper operation. Latch-up considerations In some situations, designers must be cautious about latch-up, a condition where the transistor enters a state of sustained conduction. This can occur in both NPN and PNP transistors, but the conditions leading to latch-up may differ between the two types. Proper circuit design and protection techniques are essential to prevent latch-up. Component availability The availability of NPN and PNP transistors may vary depending on the manufacturer and the region. Designers should consider the availability of specific transistor types when selecting components for a project. Component Package NPN and PNP transistors are available in various packages, such as 292, 2220, and SOD23, among others. The choice of package can depend on factors like size constraints, power dissipation requirements, and ease of soldering or mounting. Cost Considerations the cost of NPN and PNP transistors can vary depending on factors like performance specifications, brand, and package type. Designers should take cost into account when selecting components for a project, especially in high-volume manufacturing. Complementary Symmetry Amplifiers NPN and PNP transistors are often used in complementary symmetry amplifier configurations, where both transistor types work together to amplify both positive and negative halves of an input signal. 
This is common in audio amplifier circuits, where both NPN and PNP transistors are employed to achieve a full, balanced output. In summary, NPN and PNP transistors are versatile semiconductor devices with distinct characteristics and applications. The choice between them depends on the specific requirements of a circuit, including voltage polarity, current direction, switching speed, and other factors. Designers must carefully evaluate these factors to select the appropriate transistor type and ensure the proper functioning of their electronic circuits. Thermal Considerations In high-power applications, heat dissipation is a critical factor. NPN and PNP transistors have different thermal characteristics due to their internal structures. When designing circuits for high-power applications, it's important to consider the thermal properties of the transistors and ensure proper heat sinking and cooling mechanisms are in place. Biasing Arrangements The biasing arrangements for NPN and PNP transistors can differ. Biasing is the process of applying appropriate voltages to the base emitter junction to ensure the transistor operates in the desired region, active or cutoff. NPN transistors are typically forward biased, positive voltage applied to the base, while PNP transistors are reverse biased, negative voltage applied to the base. Designers need to set up the correct biasing arrangements to ensure proper transistor operation. Crossover Distortion in amplifier circuits, NPN and PNP transistors may introduce crossover distortion when the input signal crosses zero. This can be mitigated through techniques like push-pull configurations, feedback, and emitter resistors to improve linearity and reduce distortion. Voltage gain versus current gain NPN and PNP transistors can have different voltage and current gain characteristics. NPN transistors often have higher voltage gain, VC slash VCB, compared to PNP transistors, while PNP transistors may have better current gain, IC slash IB, characteristics. The choice between them depends on whether the circuit primarily requires voltage amplification or current amplification. Matching transistors in precision applications like differential amplifiers or current mirrors, it may be necessary to use pairs of NPN and PNP transistors that are closely matched in their characteristics. Transistor matching ensures balanced operation and minimizes errors in the circuit. Noise immunity NPN and PNP transistors can exhibit different noise immunity characteristics, particularly in high-frequency applications. The choice of transistor type may be influenced by the level of noise present in the circuit and the desired signal-to-noise ratio. Manufacturing processes The manufacturing processes used for NPN and PNP transistors may differ. Silicon-based transistors are the most common, but other semiconductor materials like gallium arsenide GAAS, are used for specialized applications. Understanding the manufacturing process and material properties can be important when selecting transistors for specific applications. In conclusion, NPN and PNP transistors are fundamental building blocks in electronics with a wide range of applications. The choice between them depends on various factors, including voltage polarity, current direction, thermal considerations, and the specific requirements of the circuit being designed. Careful consideration of these factors is essential for successful circuit design and operation.